Okay, there's a fight outside. These players? Let me get out of here. Looks like uh I think I'm running on Ponties. I think there's players here. Let me get let's just get out of here. I'm gonna jump right here. Yeah, there's there's it looks like players. I don't know if they're gonna chase me. But we have some beefy shields anyways. Let's clock it. Let's see if they're chasing me. If they're chasing me, we're going to jump. I don't think we're being chased, though. Oh, Starfield. Starfield is a Bethesda game. Yes, I think I saw a video from um, Space Tomato on that. I'm interested to see how that's going to be. Um, back with Microsoft Money. It may kill elite, elite, elite dangerous and star citizen. That's a big feat, man. That's a big challenge. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. This is my number one, uh, Marcos. Um, were you able to get it for uh, for its real price, or did you have to pay a stupid amount? I wouldn't get too hype about any game until it actually comes out. Yeah, I, I wouldn't get because remember, look how long it took CIG to actually even get to the point that they are right now. It took a long time. So I don't think I think Microsoft is going to give them a budget. And after that budget, they got a release similar to what happened with No Man's Sky. I don't think they're going to get infinite amount of money like CIG is getting getting from the community. I don't think so. They have to they have to build something like that. Um, What do you have to pay? Us? Bethesda doesn't have uh, the best record lately. Yeah, I heard about that. Um, I have a 2080 Super. What is a 2080 Super? Is that like the upgraded version of the 2080? Cyber Cyberpunk should have taught us uh, at this point to be skeptical until the game is in public. I completely agree with that. Um, I love them. I love them both. Uh, but Microsoft is a beast. You see what they've done with Flight Simulator 2021 yes yes they are they are good they are good but i feel like they still will give them a budget i was able to get the 3060 but the sorts the shortage happened that is unfortunate um microsoft flight simulator is uh spectacular but you cannot leave the planet that is true <laughs> you can't argue with that <laughs> um yeah i bought it i was i bought it a long time ago i just um i was just waiting for somebody to bring it from the US. Oh, I see. Okay. Um, Starfield will have to come really good to even beat Elite Dangerous. Yeah, they do. Elite Dangerous has uh, millions of star systems. It's going to be even hard to challenge Elite Dangerous, to be honest. All right, Jonathan, take care, man. Thank you, man. Thank you. Um, is Elite Dangerous a uh, new expansion good? Um, I'm hearing it's good. I'm hearing it's good. Great Dane said is good. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna one in one of these is I'm gonna buy it. I'm gonna stream it. And uh we'll see. So alright. So where we're heading for for to get this trade, we're gonna try to pick up some quantanium. I believe I believe it's Aberdeen that I wanna go to. There's two stations, two outposts that I care about. It looks like we're not being chased, but uh, let's do this. I think I'm running my Ponties, right? I think I'm running the Ponties. I hope I am. But I'm not going too far of a distance anyways. Ocean Ponties, perfect. You have a pretty good drive. Uh, 
Right. Um. So. Oh, this is the this is the prison. Is it this planet or is it Ariel? It's not here. When I see it, I'll know which one it is. Anderson, no. No. This might not be the planet. I think it's Ariel. Oh, I think it's Ariel. I think we're at the wrong planet. All right. I think we need to go to Ariel. For some reason, I had a feeling it was... Uh, I don't know why I felt like it was. I don't know why I felt like it was Aberdeen. It looks like uh somebody did subscribe on youtube thank you for the subscription for some reason the alert didn't show up but um whoever it is thank you thank you for your continual support of the channel all right so we're at aberdeen so now where we want to go for for trading will be uh let me show you guys man ariel looks beautiful man what do you guys think look at this Ariel actually looks beautiful. I feel like they they've uh they've updated it. I like it. Yes. It might be dark on this side. I think it's on the other side. Baz deck. Baz deck. They did update every planet in 1.12 you mean 3.12 you know you're right it could have been from the 3.12 update haven't been i haven't been here i haven't done trade in a long time so it, it is very possible i haven't seen it since but it, it's looking good man it's looking good Get the light on. Oh, this is beautiful, man. This is very pretty. I like it. Just quickly recording this before we crash and i have a feeling we're about to crash right now all right Let's see where it's at it's right there okay, nice. Uh, 
Oh, now we're seeing the terrain. Guess we were a little too late. We're a bit higher. Man, this is beautiful, bro. This is gorgeous. All right, so let me let me quickly land. Can I fit? Huh. Good question. I think I can fit. Barely. I think, we, I think we, we oh we got it i think this is a low gravity move there we go look at that professional landing what do you guys think about that look at that professional landing you guys know about that all right <laughs> oh man It's rated 5.2. What elite dangerous? Um, they did do some surface re uh, rendering tech for some. Okay, okay, okay. Just bought a Carrick today, Steven, What's going on, man? Congrats, man! Congrats on the Carrick. The Carrick is my favorite ship as well in the game. I might just log in and join you. Yeah, Wolf, if you want to join, man, definitely, bro. Carrick is home. <laughs> yeah, it is. I can't wait until when they fully have persistence in the game. I'm going to take my Carrick out and I'm not going like it's going to be it's going to be a hard. It's going to like I'm hardly going to be going landing on like landing at stations. I'm going to be like out. I'm going to be nomadic. For sure. I'm going to be nomadic in my character, man. Because I'm going to have everything I'm, I'm going to need. I'm going to make sure I buy everything. I'm going to make sure I buy all the food. I have enough oxygen. I have enough uh, medical supplies and everything. Have everything in the Carrick. And just go out, man. And I'll just be out there. Plus five for, for night landing. <laughs> Thank you, bro. I'm trying man i'm trying to get better i used to be terrible at landing i'm getting better man right. all right so we're looking for um titanium i kind of want to minimize any losses so i'm gonna go i'm gonna start off with titanium 7.98 is that low So 90,000, 99,000, if I sell at Lorville, I'm probably looking at 30,000 in profit. But if I pick up, oh, somebody bought all the Laronite here. Ah, oh, what a guy. What a guy. Look at this. Somebody bought all the Laronite. So these guys are still trading Laronite out here. All right. So 99,828. Whoa. Why would you leave, dude? What the heck happened? I don't know. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening.
I don't know. Did, did I not buy it? Did it not work? Okay, maybe, maybe, maybe I did. Insufficient. So maybe I did buy it. We'll verify on the character. rating is is mostly from the bugs it doesn't say if it's any good okay um i don't think people understand what persistence will mean it literally uh literally live in your literally live in your ship if you want yes absolutely yes bugs can be fixed but if it's just uh bad then it's a deal breaker for me i'm not gonna buy it now <laughs> I don't know if it's bad. I don't know about if it's bad. Marcos, I don't know. Maybe maybe if you want, you can check out a couple of streams. I'm, I think I'm going to buy it and I'll, I'll stream it one of these days. And then you can check it out. But it looks fun though. It looks fun. And I know, I know Elite Dangerous is a very in-depth game. It's it's fully it's fully developed, so there's lots there's lots to do. Okay, so my cargo isn't here. Or is it not physicalized? I can't tell. Oh, boy. So we're going to find out. We're going to have to take it. We're going to have to find out when we get to the trading district. That sucks. Yeah, 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 I absolutely agree with uh, T Love. Yeah, check out check out the reviews of it, Mar uh, Marcos. Check out the reviews of it and see if you like it. Don't really worry too much about what other people think, but if you feel like based on what you're seeing looks good to you, just try it out, man. Like I don't. That's how I. That's how I do it, man. If I if it looks like I'm gonna have fun, because everybody it's relative. Fun is relative, right? If everybody, not everybody's going to find the same thing fun. So if you find it fun yourself, like, go ahead, man. It looks good. It looks fun to me from what I've seen so far. So, uh, so I'm definitely going to try it out. Uh, why is my landing gear not? My landing gear is not going in. I don't know what's going on. Yo, Scarlet, what's going on? Ruben, what's going on? How you been? Hey, FaZe, how much uh, quantum fuel has um, the Carrick? I take the Hercules for long range. Um, has 88k. I think the, the Carrick has 44 I think the carry cast is 44. 40. Okay, this is what I currently have. But I think it's around like 48, between 48 and 44. So, that's crazy, man. Really? The Star Lifter has more fuel? That's weird. Than the Carrick? The Carrick is bigger too. They gotta fix that. They gotta fix that. Scarlet, how's it going? I don't think cargo is physic is physically there yet. I know uh, they mentioned that being something they want to implement soon, though. Yeah, no, the car the cargo was supposed to be physically there. I think it's a bug that it's not showing up. Usually, when you pick up cargo, it's supposed to phys physicalize in your ship, but I think um, it bugged out. So I'm gonna hope it's there that way i can sell it because there's no other way for me to tell right now oh shoot we're still we're still in atmosphere dude where, why is my landing gear is my landing gear broken
Marcos, thank you for the subscribe. I really appreciate it. I bought it, not, um, have not played it yet, but plan to. Oh, T Love, you're talking about um, Odyssey. What the hell was I doing in Hurston? Oh, you're at Everest? Okay. Are you on the same server as me, uh, Wolf? So my, my landing gear should be fixed. It's not fixed. Even when I jumped? Okay, my landing gear is bugged. Oh, damn it. That's so annoying. Oh, okay. Scarlet, you're new. Yeah, cargo cargo has been physicalized for a very long time. It's just a, it's a bug right now. Oh, man. Died like five times and trying to EV it to the ship. <laughs> oh, that's unfortunate, bro. Okay, let me tell you what happens to me when I, when I got the same bug you just had. When I did that, I landed at PO. My ship immediately exploded on the pad. Are you serious? Oh man, I don't want to hear that. <laughs> I have ninety thousand. I have a hundred thousand worth of cargo in my in my hold right now. I'm not trying to hear that right now, bro. I'm hoping that doesn't happen to me. I'm really hoping it doesn't happen to me. Oh man, why is my landing gear broken? How did it break? What the hell? Weird. Oh, server desync. Okay, I, 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 I know about that. I know about the server desync issue. Sometimes when I, when I do get server desync, it's like if, if, if I'm with somebody and they're landing, for example, to me to like to them they're landing perfectly fine but to me it's like they're underneath the landing pad but yeah the desync is pretty bad it looks like this this big building right here is actually meant to be a landing pad look at it look at it those are landing pads I think the, this is supposed to be a station. Those are all landing pads. I think this, this is supposed to be a station. And if you want to go down into the city, they'll take the elevators down, the trains down, because there are trains that go up these things. So I think this is actually meant to be the actual landing pad for Lorville. Wolf, you're not too far from me. I'm at Lorville just about just to let you know. I'm just about to know. That's the executive's landing pad. <laughs> I know. <laughs> they keep it to themselves. <laughs> oh man. But yeah, like if you go to like, I'm going to show you, I'm going to, when I get there, but if you go, if you go to that building right there, you'll see that the trains actually go up, up to it. So I feel like that's probably meant to be a space station as well. Please don't blow up. Forget how heavy this ship is. Oh my gosh, 
This thing is so heavy. Oh, I think we fit. Oh, is the landing pad, is my landing gear not working? Oh, shoot. Uh, whatever. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to kill myself here. That way I can spawn. Because I feel like if I might destroy the ship if I try to open the landing gear. Uh, she... So, should I stay in Everest? Yeah, stay in Everest. Stay in Everest, because... Lordville is just a buggy... It's a buggy place, man. I'll come up there shortly. Did I try the commodity price alert for... For instance, um... Helium. Yeah, yeah, I did. I did try it. You buy a price of 100k profit is 20k i did try it i tried it a couple streams back i i even tried helium i picked up some in um crusader and i brought it over to everest it was it wasn't too bad um but like i feel i feel like they need to they need to fix the price the profit margin i feel like 15 to 20k isn't worth it man i feel like it's not worth it I feel like they should give us more, you know? Um, which one takes me to the trading district? You know what? We got an impound violation. That's fun. I think this, I'll take this one. This one takes me to the trade industry. This one should take us to the yeah the central line this this one takes us to the uh business district constellation in blue livery is that a new uh skin did they did they make new uh skins for the constellation okay no problem Yeah, this one's so yeah, central business district. That's where we need to go. Alright, boy. Thank you. Thank you for the subscribe. I really appreciate it. How you doing by the way? Oh, so they did make new skins, right? All right, I gotta check that out. I'll be up. I'll be, I'll be up there shortly. Uh, oh my gosh, I disappeared. I disappeared. What the hell? weird 400k investment it's okay for 500k investment um i want a related margin of 100k or more 
more risk more money invested should bring more profit absolutely i absolutely agree i absolutely agree if i'm gonna put 500k on the line 100k is not bad that's that's like 20 percent right it's a 20 percent profit margin right there but at 100k to make 15 nah I think it's about the same actually. 100k to 15 or 20. 20k. You do the math, I think it's the same amount of uh same profit margin. But yeah, so I, unless unless I'm making like a hundred, I kinda don't want to do that trade. Because like if you're doing bounty hunting, right? You can make like like for example, um like 50 Sixty thousand, all in one, one bounty, you know, depending on the kind of bounties you're getting, you can make way more bounty hunting in just a matter of minutes, you know. So that's what it is. So I don't know what to do right now with the carrot. The carrot is bugged. So I don't know if we'll do more trading. I don't have any other trader. So I do have it. Titanium. So, oh my goodness. I sold, I bought it for nine, 900, pretty much 100K. And I'm selling it for 111. So I'm making 11,000. Not worth it. Not worth it, bro. That is not worth it at all. So if you're going to do that trade, it's best to pick up the Laronite. But unfortunately,